Once you've opened your program, the first step is to set your personal assessments and nutrition calculator. As you can see at the bottom of the screen, you'll have three tabs, personal assessments, max chart, and lean strength training program. Once you click the personal assessment tab, you'll see the screen, personal info, girth measures, which are body part circumferences that can be measured using any tape ruler, and nutrition information. You also will notice that there are two different types of colored cells, yellow, which is found throughout the program, and white, which is also found. Lastly, you'll notice that there are four blue numbers down at the bottom. It's very important that you only manipulate the yellow cells, and this is a key thing throughout your entire program. You will start by filling out all the data within the C column. You will notice that most of the data will also be auto-populated through columns D, E, F, G, H, I, and J. Lastly, you will need to set your nutritional information, which can be found in these six boxes. It is important that you pay attention and you select the correct ones, because when you enter those, these four cells, total calories, total carbs, total protein, and total fat, will all be projected for you. Now that you have set up your initial information, it is important that throughout the eight-week program that you come back to this and you fill out some information about your weight as well as your girth measures. So you can see that on the weight, the pounds, you can list them as you go and track your results. As well as in the fifth week, and at the end of the program, you will need to take girth measures again to track your progress throughout this eight-week period. Congratulations. You have completed step one, and you are now ready to move on to setting your max charts, which can be located in the next tutorial in the max chart tab. Thanks for watching. This is Mike from J2Fit Human Performance.